I'm here for three years. Interview. The whole world heard about it. That look, even the journalists ask, Young, you want to do what? No, 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 You understand? And um, respect your integrity. And you respect your word. I'm not, I'm not being disrespectful for him. If I'm the president, if I actually say it, I actually said that in, in uh, three years I'll step down. And something came up. Huh? There's two things. Either I resign to respect more, or I'll come and face the Gambians. The one that I signed with the MOU, we sit. There's something came up, this, 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 they agreed. They now come to the Gambians. We are the MOU's uh, signatories. We promised three years out step, but something came up as a Gambian. I'm urging you guys, can you give me a chance? Let me complete the other two years so that whoever come after me will be easier to complete. Mm -hmm. Everything in this world is about dialogue. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when you talk sweet, people say, well, he's a sweet talker. They even, even when they're mad at you, they will take it easy. Mm -hmm. Like you owe me, I owe you, and you come and say, but you pay me, I start showing that I'm, I'm, I have power at this, and start talking rubbish. My brother, my sister, you tell but you pay me now, 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 now. Mm -hmm. But when I say, look, sister, no, this is this. Things are kind of no rough with me. I'm pleading with you, just give me a nice talk. I said, you know, you don't understand. I'm watching the president come back to the people. It's the people who put you in power. Some of the people, they don't like the three years, man. They don't like the five years. They want you to step down. I have nothing to say with this. It's not on my concern, but as a, as a security, as a good citizen, if anything that will bring a conflict is my concern. I'm urging Gambians. I'm not forcing any Gambians. Let Mr. President come and talk to the people of Gambia. You are Gambia, and Gambia is you, Mr. President. We chose you to be our leader, to manage the resources and efforts of Gambia. Talk to your people with humility. Talk to them that I say this boldly. Gambians, we have a good heart. Explain the situation. Bring it down. That's why I'm calling for dialogue. We sit. And when we finish dialogue, all stakeholders, when we come, I will come out and talk to my sympathizers. The other political party will talk to our sympathizers. Let's look at the peace and stability of Gambia for the better and then give you another extra two years to make it 2021. And when election time comes, let's every political party go and talk to the Gambians, sell their agendas. Whoever they choose will be the next president. But now you say three, they say five, the people are complaining to me. We need peace. I'm urging Gambians. I'm not forcing. To me, let's give him five years access. I'm not working with him before you guys think that I'm working with him. You understand? I'm working for Gambia. I love Gambia. But when it comes to peace and stability, I'm urging Gambians to give him a chance, let him do his thing. And we will know that it's competent for 2020, we will know. But you know, when conflict comes after December, we argue near, we have problems of argument. We don't even know how to feed ourselves. Our youngest, our mothers, our sisters, our brothers, we are confused. Everybody's having one meal per day, not even proper meals. So let's think about a meal issue.